How's it going guys? Saturday, 26th July. I'm gonna go to the gym in a bit, but just got a package from Gymshark. You all know who it is, Gymshark. This guys is the black one with just jib shark on it. Good thing about jib shark is the material they use on the cloth, clothing, uh, pants, shorts, even the bag. It's always top notch quality. Next one, I think this is one of the newer ones. It's the navy blue, or more blue, or whatever you call it, navy blue. Stringer. So, trying them on later, try them out of the gym. It's always good to get some new tanks. I should have faced this way, the light's better, isn't it? Anyway guys, I am going to get something to eat, I've got a little, not little, chicken sandwich, so I'm going to do that, finish editing, eat that sorry, just drink some water, finish editing up this video, and then upload it, then should be going to the gym. See what else see what else the day brings, but yep. That's it for now guys, I'll uh, catch you in a bit. How's it going guys? So it is five o'clock. Only just heading to the gym now, quite late. But should get about an hour and a half in there. Should be enough time hopefully. So I've got pre-workout as usual. We'll talk about now is uh, body power. Uh, for next year 2015 I am an ambassador for body power so I will be representing body power in whatever form I can through Facebook through Twitter through YouTube through these videos and in around my area as well um, God, I look. I'm not as pale as it looks I hope it doesn't look like this on camera but anyway yeah so I'll be representing body power now tickets have gone on sale now, uh, I believe it's for either, I think it's just the weekend tickets, the, the weekend VIP, the weekend power passes, and uh, there's another tab ticket, but I'm not 100% sure what's involved in that one yet. Uh, last year I had a power pass, and I would recommend paying the extra money and getting a power pass, even if it's just a one day power pass. The freebies you get, awesome recommended but most of all you get two talks with um, two athletes and your dinner so last year it was when it was Brian Shaw first obviously world's strongest man real sound guy that was a really good talk he's a huge guy um, and he, he answered any questions you want it was it was like a bit of a Q&A over over some food and then the second one was um, Greg Plitt. Now everyone knows Greg Plitt. He's someone I've been following for a hell of a long time. Um, amazing guy. So he's funny. The, the way he tells his stories and he, he, he it's just funny. But he knows what he's talking about. He knows how what things work for him. He knows what he's not afraid to say what's bullshit and that. So I would recommend getting a power pack. So what you want to do? is in the link below if every video that I'm doing now there'll be a link to um, so the link below will be for the ticket factory my hay fever is killing me and you get a promotional code and if you put in mine which is BPDO so for like body power 
Daniel O'Connor, BPDO. And I believe you get an exclusive t-shirt. Um, right, I'm nearly at the gym, guys, so I will leave you with that. How's it going, guys? So we're, here we are, back in the gym. It's chest day, so you all know what that means. Well, you should do by now. 5x5, five five, flat bench press, strength gaining program on my flat bench press. That's what I've been trying to achieve. It's been The minute it's been going good, um, improving week by week, and I've been on a cut. So in a calorie um, deficit and I've still been making strength gains. So I've been very happy with that up to now. This workout should run 95 kg. That was that was the target, that was the plan. Five sets of five, 95 kg. Didn't go to plan. Nothing felt right, workout felt wrong. I didn't feel comfortable. Strength wasn't there. Um, positioning, I just couldn't get in the right groove to actually lift the weight. So I was getting frustrated, getting myself wound up, so I just made the decision to drop the weight, so I dropped it down to 90 kg, because I wanted to finish the workout, I didn't want to skip any of it. I didn't want to just get frustrated and just leave like that. So like I said, I dropped it to 90 kg and just did 5 sets of 3 reps. And it still didn't feel right, but I managed to do it. Then I moved on to incline dumbbell press here, I'm using 30 kg, which is, I believe, 66 pound, maybe wrong. And they, these felt alright, and towards the end of the workout I did start to get in the groove, it did start to feel a lot better. So I did two sets with the 30kg and then moved up to 34kg, which I believe 77 pound, and did another two sets of them. It was a bit of a struggle, um, I feel the 34s are harder to lift, just because of the width of the grip. Um, I think a wider grip does make it harder. So that's why I think I struggle a little bit on them. But I just wanted to concentrate and getting through the workout, like I say, guys. Just wanted to make sure I got through without giving up. And it, when you've set yourself a goal and a target, like I, I have where I'm cutting and I'm hitting the gym and I've got an image in my head where I want to get to, you're going to have bad days. And what determines if you reach them goals and reach them targets is the ability to overcome these obstacles, the ability to push through the difficult times and the difficult workouts that you do have and just picture it in your head and just plough through and that will help you in the long run, help you reach your goal or reach your target. It doesn't have to be in the gym, it doesn't have to be anything to do with the gym, it can be anything in life. Just give yourself that extra push the determination and do that little bit extra when the times are hard that's that what to reach the goals that you set yourself well that's my motivational speak over guys that's enough of that so that's it for the video guys um, i hope you enjoyed it please like share and subscribe if you did help people find the channel help the channel grow and um appreciate all the subscribers and all the new subscribers that have come to the channel so welcome and i'll um i'll see you in the next video guys